Um, yes, uh, it's probably not how we want to play in terms of the batting, but uh, you know the way Vaughan and, and Kai played was outstanding. Um, that partnership, you know, you get a hundred partnership in a T20 game. Um, more often than not, you're on the winning team. So the way they played was outstanding. Um, I thought we were a little bit dodgy up front, and you know, four wickets down for for not too much on the board. So that that didn't really go according to plan, but but certainly the way them two played it towards the end was was unbelievable, and managed to get us to a score that we could defend. Yeah, it it is extremely important. Um, you know, we've we've spent a lot of time chatting about that um, after the last game. I think everybody knows how we want to play. Um, as I said earlier, we got out of jail in the last game, but uh, yeah, I think um, it looks reasonably good on paper, but uh, at the end of the day, they need to go out there and, and make sure that that happens on the ground. So um, we, we've got an idea of how we want to play, and hopefully going forward, we can play like that more often than not. No, and probably won't again, so it is, it's, a, it's a strange one, um, but I think we do need to learn from 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 the fact that we didn't run as particularly well, um, I thought we lost a little bit of intensity um, in those first ten overs. But uh, certainly the second part of that innings was also something we need to learn from and and, and take heart that uh, uh, you know the damage that we can inflict on opposition um, if we get ourselves in. Yes, we are. Um, I think uh, it's it's a, it's a nice place to go and play cricket. The ball travels a lot. Uh, travels. Uh, really well and, and the wicket is quite good so um, in, in terms of our batting partnership uh, hopefully we can implement the plans that we've been chatting about and uh, and not just leave it to, to two guys at the end um, you know, and saying that we need to be on the money with the ball as well so it's always a fair contest out there and we're going to have to play well again to beat them. Um, it does, it does, um, you know uh, Chris is still going to be a while I think um, before he comes over and, and Graham's injured for a while so I won't have to tackle that uh, too soon. Um, but uh, certainly, as the competition goes on, it does get uh, it does get uh, quite busy. But it's nice to know that uh, you know we've got some some quality overseas uh, players that uh, we need to f we need to fit in as well. But uh, we'll deal with that as we go. Um, I think for pretty much the first half of the competition, um, it, there'll be no real change to what we've got. Well, I think it it, it makes it a, a hell of a competitive competition. You know, we don't we don't get too many pro tiers when they when they're back. Um, but certainly um, the opposition, just looking at the Titans, I think everybody bar one or two had, had, had played for South Africa. And I think that's great for you know, the local competition and it's great for, for guys that are aspiring to be pro tiers one day because you want to play against the best and you, you, you know, what a great uh, opportunity to do that than, than in the Ramslam.